saying that. I'm saying that because I really truly believe that. I'm a member of May the May 1st Coalition for Workers and Immigrant Rights, but I'm also a member and a, an official delegate of the Honduran Resistance. And what is that? The Honduran Resistance is a movement that was that was born out of resistance, the military coup, the U.S. supported military coup in my country against the, our constitutional president, Manuel Zelaya Rosales. And what I'm saying is I've been hearing over and over here at this incredible forum, which I am so uh, glad and honored to be here, and thanks for the organizers of this incredible forum, is that we all understand that capitalism is the beast. It's the beast that is destroying us here, and it's the beast that has destroyed Latin America for so many years, Africa, all over the world. But I didn't hear anyone here talking about the options, ladies and gentlemen. What are our options? In Latin America, you know, it was discovered in Cuba more than 50 years ago what the options are. We need to look at what is happening in Latin America. In Venezuela, for more than 12 years, it's happening in Bolivia, in Ecuador. It's happened in Nicaragua. It's happening now in Honduras. It's all over the place. We need to connect with the struggles of what is happening in Latin America. They have some great, great stories. They have some great lessons to teach us. And we need, we need to look at what is happening there because the colonized have awakened. And now, this country that has been the colonizers forever, they need to look over there. So we say, now, nuestro norte es el sur. Our north now is the south. We need to look at what is happening there. Lord, let the people of Latin America. Y si se puede.